Yo guys, what's going on? Welcome back to a new video. And today for you guys, we are going to be reacting to a new creator you guys wanted me to react to called Cozy Mate. I ask you guys all the time what small creators you guys want me to react to and you guys overwhelmingly wanted me to react to Cozy Mate, so I'm excited to get into this. Today we're going to be reacting to his video called Kahoot in School. I'm not going to lie to you, I love Kahoot. I got way too competitive, I'm not going to lie. I hope you guys are having a great day. Before the video starts, make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe. Thank you guys so much for all the support you guys always show. It really does mean a lot to me. Leave a comment down below who you guys want me to react to in the future and if you ever won a Kahoot game. If you don't know what Kahoot is, you're about to learn. But if you've ever won a Kahoot game, let me know. And make sure you guys leave a like on Cozy Mate's video too, but that's all I got for you guys, so let's get right into the video. Okay class, to finish off the day, we're gonna play some Kahoot. Oh, lovely. So <laughs> yeah. Okay, put the game pin in. Olivia Tom. Oh uh, gosh! Okay guys, no more inappropriate ben names. Dover. <laughs> Oh, oh, ha! Ah. Have you guys ever played Kahoot? <laughs> Alright, more specifically, have you guys ever played Kahoot in school? Yes, absolutely. You'll be sitting in class, bored out of your mind, when suddenly the teacher's like, Alright class, since it's the end of the week and I don't get paid enough for this, oh, yeah, we're gonna play some Kahoot to finish off the lesson. <laughs> Students yep. will be cheering. Now nah, Kahoot was a great time. The teacher will be standing there like, Psh, yeah, I'm definitely their favorite teacher. <laughs> so easy stuff, easy money. unaware of the absolute mayhem that's about to take place. Okay. As soon as the code goes up on the screen, you got students joining the game with inappropriate names. Absolutely, every students single time. Students pretending to be Clive. <laughs> you got students spamming hundreds of bots. Tyler over oh. here ain't even joining the game. And we got Kevin thinking he's an absolute comedian, oh, but naming himself something like a baby Yoda. The teacher nope, seeing no this laughing. will all of a sudden completely Jekyll and Hyde the heck out of their mood and be like, yep. Nah, nah, you know what? We ain't playing Kahoot anymore. I'm absolutely ashamed. <laughs> so some of you Never, ruined it. ever, in my 32 years oh, of teaching, gosh. have I ever come across such disgusting behavior from a class. Oh! <laughs> I swear you're 27. Teachers will be having zero patience when it comes to I'm not gonna lie, that got me. <laughs> and in my opinion, I think this mainly comes down to the fact that 90% of them don't even know how to kick someone out of the game. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know about you guys, but in my experience, I've had teachers that have tried to counter the misbehaving students during Kahoot. Mm -hmm. They'll whip up plan A by telling us the winner of Kahoot will receive sweets. Yeah. Now you already know, as soon as the class hears this, it's game on. Yeah, but if you want to, you got that, that crazy name, we got you. Jeremy's revising through the topic, Derek's praying at his desk, and Clive is meditating? Oh, why is he, what? Now this is something that's levitating too. to me. My teacher, Mr. Levi, yeah. started the Kahoot, and I was there for business. I was zooming through those questions like Lightning McQueen, man. See, Kahoot's also interesting because you gotta be the left, first as well. I went ahead and got the points to win the game. Oh. I was sitting there all proud and excited to get my hands on some sweets. Yes, of course. I was over here feeling like Charlie at the end of Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. <laughs> so that boy said, I'm gonna receive something. Offered him his entire some chocolate factory. today or something. The teacher stands up and rustles his hand through the desk drawers. Yeah. He pulls his hand out and I was absolutely flabbergasted what to see have? this man pull out a cough sweet. Oh, like there is bro, no what did I work hard the for then? Hype was up this reward so much what? to hand me a cough sweet the size of a peanut. That's the man. So I stood up. I don't fight you right here. Chair, <laughs> and I threw it at him. Absolutely. I'm just kidding. That didn't happen, but you that would have been sweet. No, you should have. See what I did there? No? <laughs> okay. That would have been sweet. Oh my gosh. That was an interesting experience, <laughs> but at least I kept myself a nice and healthy, unirritated fruit. <laughs> nice. Two weeks after the cough sweet tragedy, we were playing Kahoot for the last day of the school term. Okay. And I was complete and utterly outraged to see Mr. Levi hand Nathan an entire bag oh! of Skittles after winning the <laughs> maths <Skittles>. Kahoot. <laughs> Where the heck is the student equality, Mr. Levi? <laughs> that boy you know has favorites. <laughs> we're starting a student strike. A strike? Plan B of well, we just don't come to class. <laughs> was the only successful option that is still used to this day. Uh-huh. At least in my school. Yeah. Using the auto-generated names. Crazy tiger. I'll be getting all excited to join Kahoot until I see my I name used pop on the screen as Spinning Hamster 44. Really, bro? Why now my entire point, mood is ruined. And I'm not the only one either. Vanessa was fuming when her uh -huh. name came up as Suspicious Cow 667. Oh. Oh. I mean, just look at her. Fuming. Yep. <laughs> Another thing that must be discussed is the absolute <laughs> tryhards that play Kahoot. Yeah. Like we'd be doing a Kahoot about types of flags or something, 
and somehow Raiden's over here speed running the questions like he's got somewhere better to be. Now, but to be honest, yeah, if you're a dude living in the UK, studied for Kahoot, you're bound to be quiz. given flags due to the thousands of people oh, who play FIFA. Yeah. Me being one of them. Yeah. The only time I can think of being a tryhard in Kahoot as acceptable is when you are a tryhard. No, <laughs> so when, so when I would do it, it's fine. Kid. When they do it. Even those questions a thousand points ahead of everyone else is just such a good feeling. <laughs> You know what I also hate when, below you. <laughs> when the teacher lets the class decide on the subject, and you got guys over here going football teams, Good. flags, okay. football, and if I did not know any better, I'd say all these suggestions went in one of Mr. Levi's ears and straight out. That looks like geography. I got you. <laughs> I say this because regardless of all the solid suggestions recommended by the guys, yeah. the only suggestion Mr. Levi seems to hear is from Lisa at the back of the class. Uh huh. Disney princesses. <clears throat> huh? Disney princesses. Why? Why, why, like that, why was the Why was the pitch down here? Then wait. School, <laughs> trying to guess how many singular hairs Rapunzel has on her head. Why would we know this? Now this is a tough one. Anyway, guys, that's the end of the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you guys go over to Kazi's video as well, and make sure you guys leave a like there. But that's all I got for you guys, and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. See ya. Jimmy on a beat, boy.